Hey everyone, welcome back to IT Samurai Teacher. Have you ever been stuck with a error message called no space left on device? As you can see on my page, I got this message. So no space left on device error on your Parrot OS running uh, top of Raspberry Pi 5. So today I'll show you how to troubleshoot and fix this issue with the simple commands. We'll learn how to analyze disk usage, find what's eating uh, your space and clean up your system so let's jump right in uh, the error no space left on device means storage is full this can happen if your partitions are filled with logs temporary files or large unused files. Here's how to identify and fix this issue. Okay, first of all, uh, um, you can see the message because I tried to install a package and I got this message. So I'm going to uh, clear this. Um, the first one, I'm going to type df-h. So first, let's check the available space with df uh, space dash h command this shows how much space is used on each mounted partitions look for a partition that 100 percent full so normally what you need to do is just just look for partitions that 100 percent full okay it seems my root partition um, dev uh, slash mmc blk 0p2 is completely full so this is why i'm seeing the no space left on device error let's troubleshoot and free some space uh, step by step okay right? let's analyze the disk so uh, what i'm going to do here is we're going to type sudo du ahx dash uh, we got sort dash h tail n 20 right failed okay no space and so even we get a, a message like this okay you know what i'm going to uh, type another command so uh, i'm going to type sudo du dash ahx dash slash I'm going to use this time max depth one and I'm going to short h and I'm going to say tail dash n dash uh, 20 uh, so this command um, shows the disk usage of top level directories uh, shorted from the smallest to largest so from the results we can see the media uh, directory is consuming 104 gb of space that's that's unusual so let's in investigate further now uh, what i'm going to do here is um, let's check what's inside under this media to see where this space is being used i'm going to type ls dash lh media uh, so we can see folder name pi you can see in here folder name pi so let's check the disk usage inside it okay so what i'm going to do here is uh, i'm going to type sudo du ah media pi i'm going to use max depth one we sort h tail um, n 20. so let me confirm so we're going to use the pi that's the folder and right so and here it is the folder media pi backup drive uh, is consuming all the space so we narrow it down from here you can see we 
100% usage zero available so that's why we're getting no space left on device so that's mean we cannot install anything and i narrow it down and we can see this 104 me gb i mean you can narrow it down for all this uh, but for me the media is uh, is the one i was thinking because i don't i don't know about this folder so now once i get into this media file i look at and it's under pi uh, folder and after that when i uh, went inside the folder and we found out that's 104 g gigabytes used by all the space by this backup drive now since we don't know what's inside so what i'm going to do here is we need to look inside the uh, this backup sd drive to figure out what's causing this right because we cannot tell uh, exactly what's inside so i'm going to type sudo i'm going to ls lh media pi i'm going to go that so once you uh, press tab it will automatically pop up that name so i'm going to hit enter wow so here we find two files one 104 uh, gb and the other one is empty file you can see this is empty file and this one is 104 uh, gigabytes so the larger file is likely a disk image backup you can see the name so it's kind of image backup if this is a if this unnecessary we can delete it for free up space now because i know this is unnecessary you can see the name parrot backup so i found this from someone else uh, raspberry pi drive so i know uh, this is not my files and someone backup this file to the media so let's go ahead and you know we can delete this folder okay now let's uh, delete the two files to free up space always double check that there's a files are aren't important before deleting them so make sure you just make sure that these files are not important uh, whatever the files you have <laughs> so make sure those are not important and after that we can delete safely so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to type sudo. I'm going to delete. I'm going to use the delete command. Media pi. You can hit the tap button. It's automatically. Uh, okay, I'm going to use zero seven. Uh, I'm going to use the the zero thirty nine. Oh, thirty. 9 img this is the one i'm going to delete first you can see in here i'm going to type enter uh now if i go back you can see we delete then file now let's go ahead and delete the other one so 17 that other one is 41 so hit the tab button yes i delete that so you can see it's empty that's cool since we delete both files let's confirm the free space so i'm going to type uh, d f dash h and we can see available 104 gig we got that file so use seven percent so we have enough space now uh, so now our root file system now has a plenty of free space problem solved so let's go ahead all the way top this though uh command i try to use so uh, see if i get this message again and see just into enter so you can see uh, i didn't get any messages so that's mean we uh, fix the issue we fix the no space left on this device you can see before is zero percent and after that we narrow it down found the files which kept causing and we delete that after that everything looks perfect you can see we have seven percent now i'm going to give you some pro tips 
So before we wrapping up, here we few tips to prevent this issue in the future, right? So now normally, if you type df dash h, and if you think that there's a, you know uh, space eating up, uh, what you need to do here is uh, if you can't find the files or you know that you want to remove some stuff, uh, so normally we type uh, sudo apt or uh, apt auto remove and uh, we normally use sudo apt auto clean so so we can you know clean these uh, unnecessary files or we can back up uh, large files to external storage or we can use compress to uh, gzip like those kind of stuff so you can uh, prevent this error message no space on left on device so that's it for today if you find this video helpful give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more raspberry pi and linux tutorial let me know in the comments if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos thanks for watching it samurai teacher and i see you on the next one